her name. Say 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 her name. Stop playing, bro. Y'all saw the other people? They wanted to go, want to protest, they had to curfew, I get that. But I look into yeah. every one of y'all faces right now. And I can say y'all gonna go be home safe. Y'all hear me? It was us. When people look in the history books, they're gonna see us. They're gonna see every face on there. We're gonna be legendary, y'all hear me? Yeah. Y'all hear me? I look right here. I see a family. I see y'all. And I see the Detroit landscape right behind y'all. You know what I see? I see Detroit right here, not over there. Detroit right here. Y'all hear me? Y'all hear me? Y'all some beautiful people. We don't got enough, but hey, we don't need to have one, two, three, nobody behind us. Because I know what I'm marching for is right. I know what we marching for is right. I know what y'all marching for is right. Y'all hear me? Yeah. Man, I thought I was going to be a statistic or a stereotype. Shit, I could be going to be in somebody's house right now. But look at y'all. Y'all are here. We made it this far. Y'all didn't have to follow me into battle on Monday. Y'all didn't have to follow me on the battle on Tuesday. Y'all didn't have to follow me in battle at all today. But y'all did. Y'all here for me. Y'all here for him. Y'all here for you. Him. Y'all here for y'all. Y'all here for injustice. Y'all here for peace, and y'all here to tee the fuck up so they can hear us, y'all hear me? Yeah. The reason we all here is because people keep losing their lives, and like I said earlier, it don't, we don't have to lose any more lives, right? That's the reason why we all here, because innocent people are losing their lives, and we don't, wanna, we don't want that to keep happening. So we're going to do this, and we're going to be peaceful, 
but we still got demands. And like I said, we're going to have a list of demands. We're going we gonna to go to war. We're making sure these things change. We're making sure our police are from our neighborhood. We're making sure our teachers are from our neighborhood. We're making sure that the people in our neighborhood care about our neighborhood. Because the reason Detroit is where we at right now, the reason we are able to do this is because we've already flexed our muscle in the past. Our, our, our future leaders or our, our leaders in the past have already flexed their muscle and showed what we can do to a city. We've already, we've already let it be known and people are already on the fences and scared. Now it's time to speak. Now it's time to let America know that we ain't playing again and they don't want to see 1967 again, so they need to listen up. They need to listen up now. And it's time for us to speak. Like I said, it's time for us to call in, let them know, the attorneys, lawyers, and whoever defending that uh, racist cop to let them know that we ain't about that. We need first degree murder for first all of them. We need first degree for all of them. And for anybody else around this country who think they can take innocent life, we need to be, get that first degree right along with them as well. And that's what we fighting for. So we believe that we are making difference. Like I said, we got all these helicopters, we got police officers out here. We ain't turn nothing up today out here to make sure we get home, to make sure we safe. And they said they're here to support us, and I can't argue with that, but we got them to say that. Yesterday I said, what you here for, bro? Where you from? What hood you from? Oh, man, I'm from Detroit. You sure? Tell me what hood. Okay, because I'm out here looking. Why you out here? To protect and serve. Okay, well, we're going to be watching and make sure so far what they've been doing. Are we going to tell them no to get out of here? We don't need that. I mean, they're making sure we don't get hit. I got, We got family out here. We don't want to get hit. And we handle them ourselves so they can step back so we can do what we got to do. And that's how we want it. Because guess what? Some cities, their stuff is corrupt as heck. And I can't speak on that, but I can speak on my city. Some cities, I can't say they don't deserve to be tore up and destroyed. I'm not condoning that, but I understand it. Minneapolis, hey, don't expect us to be up in there speaking peace. Because guess what, man? I don't see no peace happening anytime soon. They need to let them know what's popping. But Detroit... They already on the edge and they already fearing us right now. So it's time to speak. So we need to make sure we get our list of demands ready. So when the mayor ready to meet with us, when Chief Craig ready to meet with us, we ain't gonna punk out. I'm gonna be blunt and I'm gonna let them know what's popping. Y'all with us? Yeah, let's do that. Nah, I'm good. Y'all might be upset, but what I'm about to tell you, when I was with at the time of 7 o'clock, and I made you all promise that I'm gonna get y'all home safe, so you're not gonna be able to watch the Southwest. The reason, it took us so long is because the other protesters want to stay after curfew. People protest the way they want to protest. I can't knock them down. All I can hope is that.